Hi everyone, so I just want to quickly share with you guys how to get this really cute ponytail. So the first thing that I did was I used my wand to curl my hair and these are what the items that you're going to need. You're going to need some hairspray, a comb, and three hair ties, two thicker ones and one thin one. And you're also going to need some bobby pins. So there's that. So now what you're going to do is take the front part of your hair and section it off. So you're going to take the comb and you're going to run it down the side of your head to your ear. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. So once you've done that, you're kind of going to leave this hair alone. And I'm telling you guys, this look is so easy, so simple. Every time I do my ponytail like this, I get so many compliments. All right, so that's what that's gonna look like. And so now you're gonna work on the back of your hair. So you're gonna section it off in half and you can just use your fingers to kind of get a line there. It doesn't have to be perfect because you'll see we're gonna join those two sections together later so you're gonna grab your cone comb and you're just going to smooth it out just make sure it's nice and smooth and this is gonna be like the base of your ponytail so you want to make sure that you use a thicker ponytail for this part and I accidentally grabbed my thinner one and then I realized that it was a wrong one after I had already picked it up so yeah you want to use your thick ponytail so I'm using my thick ponytail and I'm wrapping um, or tying my hair and I'm making sure it's nice and secure and that's what it looks like so after I've done that I'm going to take the comb and I'm going to just back comb the front part a little bit not too much just for now just back combing it and then you're gonna leave that alone for now and then we're going to take the bottom section of what we were doing earlier and we're going to join that with the base of our ponytail so you're just taking a comb and you're just going to smooth out the end or the bottom and you're going to take your ponytail and bring those two together and you're just going to make sure it's nice and tight how you want it and guys honestly you can make this ponytail as high and as big as you want it to be if you want your ponytail to be higher then all you're going to do is just take that base and our your base ponytail and you're going to make it higher if you want it to be bigger you're just going to tease your hair even more and you can even add hairspray as you're teasing it but i'm not i'm just using my comb but there are some days where I do want it to be a little more voluminous and so I'll add hairspray while I'm doing this. But this look is so simple, it's so easy and it's fun and it's quick. So, and your hair doesn't have to be curled when you do this. You can have, you can have your hair straight, but I like to curl my hair just to give my hair a little more volume. So now I'm bringing all the pieces together. So everything that we had sectioned off is now all coming together and I'm combing it out and making sure everything is nice and smooth and so you're gonna grab your thin ponytail now for this part because this is just to hold basically that front section of your hair because you already have two thick ponytails holding the base so I'm just tying my hair with that thin ponytail and kind of just messing with my hair a little bit as you can see i have some flyaways so i'm going to just be adding a little bit of hairspray and then i'm going to add some bobby pins just to make sure that it stays in place all day and just um fun fact about bobby pins this rigid section right here is actually meant to go on the inside of your hair and then the straight part of the bobby pin is supposed to be what is showing so the part that shows is the straight end of it and then the rigid part of it is what is supposed to go in your hair and the reason being is because it actually helps keep your hair in place so now i'm just adding some hairspray to my actual ponytail just to make it bigger and just to make sure my curls stay and yep so we're almost done here i'm just gonna grab 
my other bobby pin and I'm going to take the rigid part and I'm going to place it right there and remember the rigid part goes in and you're basically done. So like I said guys this look is super simple and you can make it as big and as luminous as you want to. All you have to do is just follow the steps that I showed you and if you do that you can make this ponytail higher and bigger. So I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Stay tuned. I'm going to be announcing the giveaway winner for the Sephora gift card. So just keep on watching. I love you guys. Hi everyone. So first of all, I just want to say thank you so, so much to every single person that watched my first YouTube video, that liked it, that subscribed, that entered the giveaway. I just want to give you all a virtual hug and tell you how much I love you and how thankful I am for you to come on this journey with me. I have all the girls who entered the giveaway. I have them all right in here. So I'm going to be choosing from this bowl is gonna be random, so I don't like I mix them all up. I don't know who I'm gonna choose. Um, and I just want you guys, first of all, to know that I'm super thankful, and this is just my way of blessing you guys and letting you know how thankful I am. I'm gonna shake this up really good. I'm not looking. Alrighty, let's see who it is. Yesenia Reyes. Woo! Congratulations, Yesenia. I love you so much. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for liking the video. Thank you for sharing it. Um, congratulations. Awesome. As you can see, this is Yesenia Reyes. So, again, thank you for every person who entered the giveaway. Um, I'm going to be doing more giveaways, okay? So just be on the lookout for that. I definitely want to be able to bless you guys. And congratulations to Yesenia. I love you, girl. You're so awesome. Let me know what you get at Sephora and tag me in it when you buy it and use it. I'd love to see what you got. So yeah, send me your email also, please, um, so that I can send you the Sephora gift card electronically. Anyways, I love you guys. Stay tuned for next week's video. Remember, I post videos every single Friday. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!